Hey everybody, it's Jilly from Bowers Dog Services, and I have um, Jax here, and he's a boxer. So I just wanted to show you that I'm going to use Hydra's um, Iron Face Cleaner today because they've got those folds in the skin, and if you don't get in there, um, then and get them nice and clean and dry, then yeast can develop, and they get yeast infections. They can lose fur. But I just wanted to show you. I put some on a nice soft rag. I don't use cotton because I think that cotton is um, it's too abrasive. Um, and I gotta tell you, this big boy stinks. <laughs> but look already. Yeah, this stuff is so gentle, so it's not gonna irritate him. And already, this you know, this is a very sensitive area. So getting into those folds, be very respectful of the fact that, you know, this boy is giving me a, a very vulnerable part of himself right now. Um, he was just like a rock star for his nails too. And I'm getting ready to give him a bath. I just really wanted to give him a nice clean up on the face. It smells better already, I can tell you that. Look at, he's got a little buildup right here. Good boy. Yeah. Good boy. All right. Dirty dog. No more. Okay, so needless to say, I said um, when I was doing his face that they stink. He stinks. So I'm, um, I'm mixed uh, the Hydra Odor Neutralizing Shampoo is what I'm going to be using on him and, and his brother Bear. Um, he's got something here. Irritation. Can you see that? See that irritation there? I'm gonna have to talk to mom. Um, I really recommend, um, Fufu Brands has these amazing, um, they're like, they look like big chopsticks, but they're um, all, they're really, uh, what you call it? They're um, for different types of all natural treatment. Um, they have one for calming dogs with anxiety. It's got passion flower in it, um, among other things. They have one for protection, which is really critical in the winter for their paws. You can put it on their paws, their nose, um, on the protection and the hot spots as well. Um, and also they have one um, to soothe. The soothing one is for more for hot spots. Um, and I like that, so I'm gonna, um, recommend holy moly are you dirty I'm gonna recommend that this these boys um, I haven't checked out on um, bear yet but Jax definitely needs something on that area holy moly you smell so much better so this is the second part of his bath I did bathe him once already um, I always bathe twice, and I'm going to use the um, Hydra Thermo Mask, the Flash, Flash Active Thermo Mask. I'm going to use that on him today um, and on his bro. Give his coat some really good moisture um, against uh, whatever he's got going on to make him feel that situation. He's big, but he's a very good boy. Just a little tip. I know, you know, veteran groomers know this, but newbies may not. And I'm still a newbie, but it's something that I learned. When you're um, bathing and rinsing a dog, I always go against the grain of the fur to lift with the hose to lift up the fur and make sure that you're getting everything really nicely rinsed. So here we go with the thermoactive. The Flash Thermoactive Mask, and it's only 90 seconds it's to stay on the coat. <laughs> hey, man, this Loyalty Pet product smell keeps me dry. It just, like, rolls off. So he's really big. This dude is, like, 80 pounds. So I'm using um, a little bit more than um, you would, like, normally need. But he's a big boy. And so I'm going against the grain of his coat with this. And just, there we go. That's that nice spot. Auntie's got that for you, huh? 
And yes, I condition faces. Yes, 100%. Why wouldn't you? You guys get facials, right? So we want this to stay healthy. Okay, that's a good boy. Jack said that's a good boy. He love him. He thinks he's a little puppy, but he's not. So now I'm letting this, as I mix it in, this is doing it. So you only have to leave it on for 90 seconds. So I am just gonna rub it in for that amount of time, minute and a half. He's gonna smell so good. While I'm waiting, I am going to clean his ears. And I use um, an organic ear wash by Opie and Dixie. You guys, I love this stuff, okay? It is all organic and it is made with um, spring water, spring water, peppermint, um, spearmint, lemon eucalyptus, tea tree, and rosemary. So I shake it up and I'm gonna wipe out any earwax you may have going on very gently. Now remember that a dog's ear canal, you lift straight up and the canal goes down, okay? So you don't pull back, you don't pull forward, and you gotta make sure that you are very respectful. It's a very vulnerable area. You don't wanna go too deep. And I don't use cotton, because they bleach cotton, and I believe that those fibers are just too caustic. Yeah, he's got a big chunk of something down there. Let me lift it up. Get that out. Yeah, there it is. Dirty ear. Okay, clean spot. A little more. So this also um, it um, helps to prevent ear infections and it helps to treat them. I've seen this organic stuff do wonders for some dogs with some serious ear problems. They like this. And I can't believe the way that it just gets rid of, come here and show everybody, the way it just gets rid of um, all that earwax. It cleans them so well, even on the ear flap. You know how it just kind of builds up there and stays there? Look at my face, look at that. Age. Yeah, this ear is a little bit dirtier than the other. So I will tell mom, yep. Oh, that looks so much better. There, good, yes, good boy. Okay, so now, for sure 30 seconds have passed. Let me rinse this boy off. He's like drinking the water. <laughs> All right. Rinsing tips start at the highest point of the dog because then it'll all drain down. Because if you don't, then you're just going to end up having it spread itself down into the other end of the coat. You don't have to re rinse again. So start at the highest point. Obviously, the head. Let me rinse this area nice and well. I don't even know what that's all about. So now I'm going again. The way that he's cold lay. Okay. Making sure I'm getting all these areas nice and rinse. By the way, that's his brother, Bear. They do everything together. Bear's next. So I'm running my hands all over him. I need to make sure that I've got all of this out, okay? Because he's obviously got some sensitive skin issues and I don't want anything to irritate it, even though Hydra is pH balanced and all that great stuff. Wow, bud, you smell so much better. All right. Get your spit out of the drain, silly. All right. And that said, I am gonna dry off those ears and that face. And 
give him a good dry with my force dryer. My brand new K9-3. Uh, good towel. Also saves you time in grooming. And I am timing myself now, actually. having that on him. Poor baby. Nice dry area. Josh, it's such a good boy. That's such a good boy. How'd you get to be such a good boy? You're so big. The dog is so big. Oh my goodness. Look at she got two ears. Ozzy. Why? Because I want to make sure they're dry. Do you guys talk to your dogs while you're bathing them? Like have a conversation for them, with them. Nice booty. <laughs> you big boy. He's about 85 pounds. He's definitely overweight, but that's okie doke. Mom's aware they just got back from the vet um, just a few days ago, so. They have a plan in place. So do I, is to dry this big mug. So I'll talk to you later. Hey everybody again. Um, so I got a bear in the back. I forgot to video. Um, so yeah, I just finished his uh, second shampoo and sorry for the bad view. That's how he wants to stand. But he's busy watching the birds and the traffic out the windows. And I'm getting ready to do his ears and his thoracic mask. I have already done um, his nails. I wish I had remembered to record it for you to do his nails. But so again, Hydra Flash Thermal Active Mask. Um, this stuff's awesome. He's a little bit smaller. A little bit of smaller bit. You don't need much. This stuff will last me a long time, even though I um. You know, it just depends on each dog. Um, I really like this on, um, you know, dogs that don't have coat for groom, um, you know, haircuts. It gets right in deep because they have more exposure to the elements. And again, while this is setting in, ah, oh, so good. It smells so good. Mama's gonna be so happy. No stinky boys. So again, I'm going to do his ears while I wait for that to set in for the 90 seconds, because I only need 90 seconds. So I'm mixing up my Opie and Dixie, natural, 100% natural organic ear wash. Um, helps eliminate internal and external infections, and I usually sell it, but um, I also sell it, but I got it because I, I um, try and sell what I use. We got dirty ears. Just a minute, buddy, just a minute. They drink a lot of water. I wonder if he has to go. Can I? My self longing for change. Yeah, as you guys get to know me, I gotta do a get to know me video. As you guys get to know me, um, I spent a year in Nashville, Tennessee um, when I was uh, 23 and 24, singing, playing guitar. Um, I love music. Music runs in my family. My brother's been playing the drums and uh, he's got perfect pitch. And he's been doing that since um, the day I was born. So he's got his first drum set at four years old. And I remember being a teenager and being in his car and singing to the radio and he told me that my voice was too breathy. But that was my head voice, not my chest voice. But anyway, um, yep, I love to sing, so I'll do that often. Um, best thing I ever did was get a Bluetooth speaker for my bathroom. It's a fan, a light, and a Bluetooth speaker, so I can uh, hook up my music directly to it, and I sing my head off in the shower, and it's a really good release. Sorry, I have to clean up this edge. It's driving me nuts. It's dirty. From when you put his hands up, his paws. Okay, ears are clean. Time to rinse the thermal, flash thermal active mask. Start up from the top, the head, checking those ears. 
We got a couple of good boys here. And I can tell you, they're pretty rambunctious when they come. Ah! All right, do you see how it just rolls off? Rolls off. I'm not wet. This is a really good smock, you guys. I recommend you get enough so that you can use my code, which is Jilly10. Yes, I am a loyalty pet products ambassador. So use my code. I don't really make any money. I just really believe. I don't make that much money off of it at all. A um, couple bucks. But I really believe in the company. And a lot of the products that they have are just phenomenal. And they're very amazing people. And they have big ideas. And they want the grooming industry to grow in the direction that I want it to grow in. And I was also, oh, no, you don't, a high school English teacher uh, for 17 years before grooming found me. I retired early, and then grooming found me um, a couple years after that, two years after that. Sorry about the butt shot. <laughs> sorry, not sorry. Um, so, um, yeah, I want to get back into education, um, but for grooming, if I can, we'll see. All right. No skin issues on this boy, that's for sure. And he doesn't have the folds on his face, uh, on his muzzle like his brother does. So, yes, I see you. I see you, and I do has your brother. Let's try this face and these ears. You ready? I do that double ear dip with the towel. God, I can't wait to do my hair again. Before I left the shop the other day, um, Yesterday, um, I hadn't washed my hair in a couple of days and I was like sick of it and I wanted to go out and uh, have a beer and like a cheeseburger. So, but I was not leaving the shop looking, <laughs> I like like similar to this, but worse. Um, and uh, um, so I washed my hair here um, in the tub. I just flipped my head over and I used the moist shampoo and the conditioner Oh my god. I also use the um the detangling um no the, yeah the detangling no 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 at the end of it I use the finishing spray the thermoactive spray um and I wish I had the aerosols I can't wait for them to come but anyway dried my hair put a little curl in it and um and then use the hydra spray at the end I was thrilled, like my hair felt the best that it has in a long time. So I was just curious because I really love how the dog's coats feel after using these products. So I was curious about myself and uh, yeah, loved it, loved it. Might order a small bottle and bring it home and use it on me. I'm going to use it for a few days and see what my true result is because you know, you use it once and you get a good result. So I wanted to see. What's the long-term result going to be? All right. I'm going to move him over to the table to dry. All right, so I just wanted to show you guys. Um, the table is all the way to the ground, but I use, got a belly band here. Okay, that's to keep him on the table, to keep it from tipping. I have a front lead here and a lead here, just to keep him safe. And I'm also gonna put the happy hoodie on him. Make sure those ears are protected. And remember, the short muzzle. So you just want to make sure he feels safe and secure. Okay, and his brother's just sniffing around. You can tell from his body language that he doesn't feel so secure about the dryer, so I don't have it on full power.
God, I love this dryer. He's almost done. So I'm timing myself now, um, but I also wanted just to to show you. Um, all right, this dog is safe, and it's really important that you keep them all safe, even if they come into you like twice a week for a bath. All right, so he's got that front lead. A lot of you guys use the um, that uh, that groomer's thing. I can't remember the name of it. I don't know. It. I don't have it. I have a lead from the top. I have an an overhead bar, and I use the belly band. All right. And that is grooming safety by Jessica.com. This thing is amazing. The black one, this one is waterproof, okay? It's waterproof. So this also allows me, I can move it, I can dry under it. I have the different sizes. So I just wanted to show you a little bit of um, what it's like just to give a dog a bath, okay? And these boys are so good. So please remember to hit the subscribe button now. <laughs> and oh, let me get this boy down. I will see you next video. Bye.